Hey guys, you're here for Infinite Crystals. This uses a glitch I covered three years ago. If you activate a charged melee and immediately switch to a sword, you keep your melee energy. This works with some melees. This will be using the Howl of the Storm aspect on Titan. You will want to slide, then swap to a sword and activate melee at around the same time. This isn't easy to do. I got it to work on last gen and next gen consoles though. Yes, PC too. For the default controller layout, I changed melee to double press, switched to power weapon 3 to single press of the melee, and crouch I mapped to the same button as swap to kinetic or energy. Now I can swap with Y, then as soon as my weapon swaps, I spam the melee button 5 times fast. If I'm lucky, crystals will come out, then I repeat. Since I don't like spamming the RB button, I remapped them both to B instead. After doing this, you can destroy the crystals for stasis shards. Collect those for overshield and abilities. Plus add elemental shards and elemental wells to get charged with light for protective light or high energy fire. Add supercharged and energy converter for fast super energy when throwing grenades. This glitch may react differently with different handling stats and swords, but generally it seemed to work with anything. Is infinite crystals broken in PvP? Not really. I don't think many people will be able to do this consistently. And if they did, it's not like people approach crystals anyway. Elemental shards doesn't even work in PvP. Is this the only way to do it? No, you can just swap to your sword and spam melee and get this to work. I just find you have better timing when you swap weapons before swapping to a sword. Jeez, forever, Guardian.